Welcome to a video from thedigitalize.com New Windows 10 build to look at. This is build 17686 for Windows Insiders on the fast ring and for skip ahead. And I get the feeling that development's kind of focusing on um, finishing off the last few features and then on the polish and reliability of Redstone 5. There are some new features in this build, but I guess it, I, I get the feeling it's more about sort of the polish now and or reliability to get it finished off. So the new feature in this build is an updated uh, local experience. And here we are in region uh, where you can set the, your uh, region format, your language, your calendar, your day of the week, your date format, all that in one currency, all that in one screen. So it kind of replaces it that it was a bit sort of dotted all over the place. And here in the language screen, you can add a language pack rather than going to the store. You can do it all from here. It doesn't actually use the Microsoft Store to get the language pack, but it's all here in one place. There's um, a privacy pop up if your microphone setting is uh, blocked by privacy reasons as well. That that pops up. So the other changes are uh, for Windows Mixed Reality. I can't really show you that on here, but I've got lots of Mixed Reality videos on our YouTube channel. Um, you no longer need a monitor connected when using uh, Windows Mixed Reality. So you could have a pack, backpack PC running Mixed Reality, and you could. Uh, yeah, so you don't need the actual physical monitor connected. People have been using dongles and all sorts to get around that. You do need it for the initial setup, but once you're up and running, then you don't need it. So that's nice. And the uh, capture, media capture UI or the camera capture UI is, API is available to apps. So you can go straight into, say, the mail app and take a photo in your Windows Mixed Reality environment without having to uh, take the photo using the, the camera app and then go to your app to your say your mail app to send that picture you can do it all in one and um, they've adjusted the video capture experience as well to make it easier to stop just a wordy warning for windows mixed reality users though um, it does reset your whole environment after installing this build so you are sort of doing this whole setup again um, so that's it maybe an issue if you're not happy doing that then avoid these builds there's some general fixes um, there's some general fixes. They fix an issue with Paint and WordPad and um, emoji panels. So there are some still some issues with dark mode and the control panel, but dark mode is looking a lot better now. So here's File Explorer in dark mode, and yep, yeah, it's definitely looking better. I think um, there's still some issues around the file um, save dialog box, but uh, dark mode is uh, certainly improving, and a lot of people like that. Like I said, there's some known issues about uh, mixed reality portal, some fonts that may not download from the store. So those are the main changes. You've still got sets in here uh, that was introduced a while back, um, which I am uh, do like using sets, which is good to see. So those are the main changes in this build. There's, um, I think, more reliability improvements to come, maybe a couple more features. That's the changes for 17.686. So 7th of June 2018. Thanks for watching this video. Head over to thislifestyle.com or our YouTube channel for more details. Thanks for watching.